It's the Andy Griffith Show, Facts and Trivia, with your host, Bob Snap. Uh, hi, guys, and welcome to the Andy Griffith Show, Facts and Trivia. Thank you for being here. Uh, today's video is on uh, Andy Griffith Revealed. Uh, the last thing, what the last thing was he said to George Goober Lindsay. A lot of people aren't too keen on sharing their feelings for fear of seeming weak. But the best of us know that being honest about how you feel isn't a symptom of fragility. It's a sign of strength. It was a lesson that took Andy Griffith and George Lindsay a long time to learn. But once they had gotten older, they realized how valuable it truly was. According to a 2012 article in the LA Times, uh, that announced the passing of Lindsay. The paper recalled a statement that Andy Griffith had made regarding his former co-star on The Andy Griffith Show. I'm happy to say that as we found ourselves in our 80s, we were not afraid to say, I love you, Griffith said. That was the last thing George and I said to each other. I love you. Viewers will remember Lindsay as the goofy goober pal, cousin of Jim Neighbors, Gomer pal. Though their time together as co-stars was long gone, Griffith made it clear that their admiration for one another had never disappeared. George Lindsay was my friend. I had special respect for his talent and his human spirit, the actor said. It was a respect that the Lindsay clearly reciprocated. In an interview with the Times, he called Griffith the greatest teacher I've ever had. Originally, Lindsay had some difficulty with the role and couldn't get a firm grasp on the character of Goober. For assistance, he turned to Andy, who was able to help him come into his own. He kept telling me to play myself, to let it happen to me, happen to me. Instead of trying to be funny, Lindsay said. <clears throat> found this, and I thought this was one of the greatest things I've found. Uh, I just, I love how the, the cast loved each other, uh, really loved each other. Uh, even with, uh, say, Francis Bobby A and Andy Griffith, it came down to it. Our final uh, words to him was, was about forgiveness and respect and love. You know, so, I mean, it's... I love this show, man. I just love this show. Okay. Monday, uh, the Beverly Hillbilly Spikes and Tribute will be changed into classic rural comedy facts and trivia. And uh, we'll be doing different kinds of, uh, from the sitcoms to the TV shows, I guess. Somebody mentioned Dukes of Hazard, and I'm like, that definitely got to do that one. Uh, but uh, we're talking Beverly Hillbilly's uh, Petticoat Junction. Um, Green Acres, uh, Mr. Ed, Hee Haw, um, Andy Griffith Show, maybe RFD, you know, all those kind. And so I'm hoping you guys will check into that. Uh, right now, uh, the uh, link is the same, and it is in the description below if you've never been there and you want to check it out. And I know you do. So, uh, and if you need the link, just holler at me. And, and it'll be up on Monday and going, though. So um, be sure you check that out. Um, classic TV facts and trivia is on the Dick Van Dyke show today, and it's on uh, how Mary Tyler Moore said, um, I'll tell you what, I'll let you check it out. I don't really want to repeat what she said because it kind of takes away the whole spiel, but it's right here if you want to read it. <laughs> anyway, that's all I have for you. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please don't forget to subscribe if you have not yet. Please like this video. Thank you. And if you know anybody who would like to know what's going on here, please share it out. Thank you very much. You guys have a great day. God bless. And I'm praying for you.